Hey everybody. How y'all doing? Uh, yeah, Tuffy's hurt himself. You must see him limping. He's carrying his back leg a little funny. See how he's holding it up? He was running through the house here today. It's wiped out and fell over and hurt himself. But anyway, it's, uh, I don't know, it's been a while since I've done anything. And I've been working a lot. This is the first day off in a while. It's like 56 degrees out here. Very nice. Anyway, I thought I'd mosey out here and try to take damage, check damage on things. We uh, had some snow that melted off in about a day. And uh, I never have got around to putting a cover or building a resting place for these guys, keep them out protected from the weather. So if I just see if uh, see if I start, you know, the boat battery's probably dead, and the lawnmower and the Kawasaki, the go kart here. I got this little tarp that I had put over the roof. I guess the weight of the rain that we've had caused excess weight on it. And all I did was put grommets in it like this and zip tied it on there. And here on this side it's pulled them all the way through as a double double layer of canvas there on the edges where I hemmed it. It pulled one out here and pulled one out here. I guess it stretched. I pulled one out back here too. So that's looking pretty sad. Anyway, I'm going to get the key and I'm going to see if that cow has got any juice. Anyway, that's a good sign. Oh, hey, I want to tell you guys. I had uh, been in contact with one of my subscribers or one of my viewers, uh, NEO, Neo 24NY. And he was asking me questions. I guess he has one of these machines. And he was asking me different questions about. Uh, specifications like piston sizes and rings and things like this he's thinking about rebuilding his but in the process I told him to keep his eye out if he happened to find a pair of rings a set of rings for a 67 millimeter which is the one millimeter millimeter upgrade when you bore out your cylinders on these that's as big as you can go on these it's either a half a millimeter or a full millimeter. And you may remember when I was building this, I've got that piston, this board one millimeter over. I've got the, the cylinder and piston for the 67 millimeter. But I don't have any rings and couldn't find any. Well, he ran across them the other day and sent me a message to tell me about them. They were on eBay. And I bought them. So those should be here probably by the end of the week. And this thing's already put together and uh, running sweet, you know, when it has gas in it. Uh, 
but I, I think I'm going to be selling that, you know, that jug and piston and ring set. So, uh, if any of you are interested, let me know. Send me a message. Otherwise, I'm probably going to put them on eBay and, you know, just get my money back on all that stuff and hopefully help somebody else out. It's like probably the last existing 67 millimeter one one up that you can go. Otherwise, you got to go back to whatever, you know. But anyway, I just want to share that with you. That's great. Thank you, Neo24NY. And uh, I appreciate that. Shucks, let's see if the old big red will start. Or big green in this case. This little fella just needs some gas, I'm sure of it. So anyway, yeah, I'm a little tired. My last day off was Thanksgiving, and uh, we've just been working every day. And this is Christmas Eve, the day before Christmas Eve. I have to go back to work tonight, which means tomorrow morning when I get off, it will actually be Christmas Eve. But we get tomorrow night off. Yay, which means I actually don't have to work on Christmas morning. Yeah, but I do have to go back to work Christmas night. Huh? How's that? Isn't that great? Yeah, I'm excited. Anyway, I've been whooped or slick. Um, that's why you haven't seen much from me. And that's why I'm not going to mess with that chainsaw today. Uh, but it is nice to get out here and chat with you guys for a minute. And uh, see that the battery in the Kawasaki didn't die. And that the three-wheeler started right up. And just kind of get some fresh air. You heard how the dogs were barking when we first came out. They're excited. They haven't been out here with them in a month. But anyway, just wanted to say hey. Thank you for watching, and hopefully I'll have some more interesting content in the near future. So, stay tuned. Uh, Alright, be good. Thanks. Hey guys, just want to welcome all my new subscribers. Thanks for watching, and want to wish you all a Merry Christmas. Take care.